I'm 16. You're 16, and tenor or alto? Tenor. Okay, what's your question for Sonny? Uh, my question for Sonny would be, how do you use your everything you learn when you're practicing, how do you translate that into your playing? Well, it's a very deep question, Kirby. You realize that, don't you? Yep. <laughs> you do? Okay. Practicing is practicing. You do your rudiments and you concentrate very hard and you put your books down. When you go out on the stage, as I don't know if you're doing that yet, but you will be one day, then you forget your books. You forget the books, but you've imbibed the music already. The music is part of you. So you forget practicing. When you're on the stage, Kirby, you let the music play you. You don't play the music. You don't play what you practice at home. You let the music play you. And to do that, you have had to really had a good practice session at home. So you understand the material you're working with, if it's songs, if it's whatever kind of uh, piece of music it is. Then, Kirby, when you get on the stage, that's already in your head already. The music is there already that you've learned practicing. So when you're on the stage and you're in a playing position, then you forget it. You let the... the See, music is a very mystical force. It's something nobody can describe exactly what it is. And that's what you're looking for when you're playing on the stage. That's what you want. You want to get to that place, but nobody can describe it. And then you let that music just play you. And everything you practice will come out. But don't think about it. Don't try to play what you practice at home. <laughs>